People have been telling me that my hair looks like celery. And guess what? They're not wrong. <laughs> Hello everyone, how are you? It's Lindy. And welcome to yet another hair dyeing video. Sorry he wasn't in my last video, but he was sleeping and I didn't want to wake him up. But now he's here again. Look at him. Our baby. He? So yeah, um, I bleached my roots and I thought that it was a cute look with my green hair. That was until I took a look in the mirror and I saw that it looks absolutely ridiculous. So today I'm going to try to go from celery to white onion. Since my hair is already literally breaking off of my head, I'm not going to use bleach today. I am actually going to use the beautiful color wheel to try and get the green out of my hair. I've used this technique before and I gotta say it works amazing. However, you do have to make sure <laughs> that you use the right colors to color correct because the last time that I tried to color correct my hair I didn't use the right colors and my hair turned yellow. <laughs> so yeah, let's hope that that is not going to happen today. So basically what you want to do is you want to create a mixture that is going to be the opposite color of the color that you have in your hair right now. So I have a little bit of green here um, and the opposite color of green is red. So I'm taking my conditioner. Pablo, do you maybe need some attention right now? He is such a little baby, it's actually insane. Baby, Pablo, Pablo is a baby. Boop. Oh, good catch. Good catch, my dude. I'm going to take my conditioner and some red hair dye, mix it up, put it in my hair, and then hopefully I won't have a green hair anymore. That would be sick. That would be sick. Okay, so I quickly mixed. My hair dye, um, I don't know why I did all of that. Anyways, um, this is the color that I have right now. It looks like it's not gonna work, but maybe it is. We, I don't know, we'll have to wait and figure out. I just, I really just wanna like take a bite out of it. Okay, let's just put this beautiful stuff in my hair. <laughs> uh, I should probably do a strand test first, but I'm not going to do that. I mean, you guys can just see me as your strand test. Like everything I do, I just do to show you how it's gonna end up looking. Oh my God, my hair is turning pink. Did I use too much hair dye? Probably, I don't know. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> I literally, I just don't care. I'm gonna have pink hair today. Okay, fine, well. I mean, it definitely looks less green right now. So I guess I'm doing at least one thing right. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. But I really hope it's gonna look good. Bing, bing. Oh my God, can y'all stop stealing cars? I'm filming a video. Rude. Okay, I think I got my entire head covered. Um, I feel like there's still a few pieces of green in there. Oh my god, this is still very green. Let me, let me make you pink as well. Bitch. Yes. Boop, 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 boop. Hello. Maybe I should not celebrate until I see the actual end result because knowing me, it's probably gonna turn out blue or something. I don't know. But yeah, everything is in my hair. I'm actually matching with my shirt right now. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Huh. Who would have thought? Anyways, um, I'm going to let this sit in my hair for about uh, 10 minutes and then I'm going to rinse it out. And then. Uh, I'm going to show you guys uh, what it looks like. Uh, uh. Ta-da! Oh, <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, I'm dizzy now. I don't have green hair anymore. Look at my white onion hair. It's amazing. Also, I kind of washed like half of my makeup off in the shower. So that is why I look like this now. Anyways, I'm a magician, if I say so myself. All the green is gone. No more celery. I have transformed myself into a white onion. Well, more a yellow onion, to be honest. I did use a little bit too much pink in my mixture though, <laughs> because my hair is pink on some places, but very light pink. So that's just gonna wash out in like one or two washes. Um, but since I never know when to stop fucking with my hair, I'm just gonna do another thing today. Yeah. I mean, the color is kind of cute right now, but I just want it to be a little bit less yellow. So I'm just gonna lather my hair in some um, silver shampoo. I got two different ones. I don't really like this one that much, but I don't have enough in this one. So I'm just going to mix them together and put it in my hair. And hopefully uh, my hair is gonna look a little bit less like this. So let's do it. Let's put some silver shampoo in my hair. <laughs> Mixing like all the professional hairdressers do. <laughs> oh, it smells like bubble gum. Okay, never noticed that before. Anyways, hey! I already know that I'm gonna get so many like patches in my hair, <laughs> but that's fine. I think I don't know. I'm used to having fucked up hair. Oh my god, what? What you say? on here how did I do that <laughs> is it also my wall <gasps> on my white wall oh no oh my god <laughs> okay well I'll clean it up a different day <laughs> this is giving me flashbacks to when I was bald <laughs> oh my god Never again. I'm just gonna let this sit in my hair for not too long because my hair is so porous that if I let this sit in my hair for too long, my hair will literally turn purple. So I think for like, I don't know, 10 minutes maybe. Something like that. And while I'm gonna let this sit in my hair, I'm just gonna clean my house because my floor and wall is covered in silver shampoo. And I have still no idea how I managed to do that. <laughs> okay, let's hope my boyfriend won't find out. <laughs> is out of my hair I am more of a platinum blonde right now I don't know if you can call this platinum because it's like it has so many different colors <laughs> when I put the silver shampoo in my hair I did not realize or like I did not see that I still had a decent amount of green in my hair because I literally had green like all around my head so once I <laughs> rinsed the silver shampoo out of my hair um, honestly it it looked, I mean, it looked kind of cool, but also it really wasn't what I was going for because it looked like this. <laughs> so what I ended up doing was I just washed my hair like two times to get like most of the silver shampoo out. 
Indeed, I color corrected my hair again, but honestly, I still have some. I still have some green in my hair right now because honestly, green is the devil and it's gonna stay with me until eternity. So yeah, this is something that I have to deal with now. I just want to say that my hair looks like way greener on camera than it does in real life. Like, I don't know what's going on, but my hair really isn't this green. Like, yeah, I still have like some green. Anyways, as I was saying, my hair is actually not green, okay? I only have like a few green spots on the top of my head, but the ends of my hair are not green in real life. So, my camera is just playing me and I don't know why. But yeah, overall, I would definitely count as a success because my hair is way less green than it was before. So, applause, applause. But anyways, I'm already bored with the blonde hair. Because <laughs> just blonde, it's just not my vibe, okay? The only reason why I did all of this was to kind of like get one even color on my head. So it was gonna be easier to dye again. So yeah, I will definitely be dyeing my hair either next week or the week after that. <laughs> Keep tuned, bitches. Anyways, this was today's video. I hope you liked it. I also hope that you learned something. For everyone out there who has hair dye in their hair and they wanna get rid of it, please don't immediately whip out the bleach, but maybe try color correcting because it works and it is not damaging to your hair at all because dye is not damaging to your hair okay a lot of people don't really realize that but hair dyes are not damaging to your hair like the semi-permanent hair dyes is just like a color deposit on your hair it's not it's not damaging at all it's basically just putting a conditioner with pigment in it in your hair so it's not damaging what is damaging to your hair though is bleaching it and putting color removers in it and putting vitamin C in it and not doing all that other stuff that I do. So like that is damaging. Dye is not damaging. So I will be dyeing my hair again. <laughs> oh, and by the way, if anyone is going to do this method, I just quickly want to say, please only do this when your hair is already very light. Because if you're gonna do this method on like a brighter color, your hair is just gonna turn brown. So yeah, that's just something that I quickly want to say before you're gonna keep me accountable for your hair failures, okay? <laughs> I mean, the general rule of thumb is just to not listen to anything I say when it comes to hair. <laughs> Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you liked it. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, please follow me on my Instagram, on my TikTok, and on my YouTube over here if you do not follow me yet. Because I would really appreciate that. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye!